Afternoon everybody, we're here at uh, Franny's Beef and Catering out on the uh, west side of Chicago here and uh, this is supposed to be the real deal when it comes to Italian beef and ice, right? This is one of the you best said places. this beats uh, Al's Beef here, huh? Oh yeah, this is one of the best beef places in Chicago. It's on River Oak close over here. It's a great Italian family. They've got great ice, great beef. They got a lot of great fries. It's a good place. This is okay. really, I consider it part of authentic Chicago. And anybody right. who comes to Chicago should come here. Okay. Good people, good food. Since 19, what is that? 19, 1991. 1991. All right, let's head in. Yeah. Italian beef. How are you good. How are you doing? Italian beef. What do you recommend? Yeah, just the beef, the Italian beef. I well, you want the ice too, right? Yeah. You try the ice. And the ice, you have the Italian, what flavor is the ice in? He's putting the Italian beef together there. It's going to be very delicious. I hope. Just like Al's beef. There is the Italian ice with the uh, beef. The Italian beef, it looks pretty good, huh? Well, fully loaded. It's a nice looking sandwich. Really got nice lemon flavor, nice and smooth. Good stuff. We're having the Italian ice with friends. I love this place. It's a long haul out yeah, from the uh, it's, it's a little bit of the airport. Yeah. I think it's uh, in my opinion one of the best beasts in the city. They have great ice. Well, they have a lot of other things here. Too. Thanks for paying it forward today, so I'm gonna go ahead and give this a try. It's pretty darn good. I'm gonna take a bite and tell me what makes it so good. Okay. Well, just to show you guys, this is uh, their Italian beef sandwich here. It's nice, thin, like it should be. I didn't get it with peppers this time, so it's just dipping some juice, sliced thin, some nice hearty bread. It's an invention of Chicago, and I'm going to take a bite out of it. They didn't invent it, but they perfected it, huh? So it's a winner, you know. It's really good. It's uh, juicy, it's spicy, good on you. Bread is great. It's one of my favorites. The beef sandwiches in Chicago. I think the raw Jew here is the best. All right. All of Chicago. It's one of the best ice. And if anybody's in Chicago, you got to come and try Brandy's. All right. Beef. I'm going to go ahead and give it a whirl. Okay, Rosie is going to try the beef of Franny's, see what she thinks about it. Good flavor. Get in the juice and bread. Good flavor on the beef, not dry. Let me show, let me show. Juicy. And, uh, good bread, good substantial bread too. Yeah, good stuff. What do you think about the ice? This is great. This is tremendous. Cool. All right. There it is. Franny's beef. All right, reviewing Franny's beef out here in Schiller Park, uh, outside of uh, Chicago near O'Hare. Definitely worth the drive. Uh, you know, Marshall picks out these experiences. They're not necessarily, you know, I want something close by, but it's something that's going to be better than average, and it's on most cases, it's going to be great, and it's going to be uh, value for your money. The Italian beef that they served up here is superior to Al's. They slice the beef. The au jus they use was excellent. Not too salty, chock full of beef flavor. And if you're going to get the Italian beef, I think you really have to get it uh, wet out here and dip it. You know, they put the all chew on it, and it makes it so good. The bread they use is good. It holds up very well. The uh, quality of the bread that they use, I think, was great. It was tasty. didn't fall apart on me, which is excellent. So I rate that the real highlight here. But the Italian ice was every bit as good as that. It wasn't 
Uh, it's got some chunks of ice in it, but I'll tell you what, for banging lemon flavor that's bright and it really sparkled out here, it was outstanding. So good pick, and I want to thank uh, Marshall for paying it forward for a really excellent uh, foodie experience out here at Schiller Park. Yeah, it's a great beef, guys. Like Rosie's saying, great uh, beef juice flavor. The spices and the beef flavor in that aju is great. The bread holds up. The, the, the Italian beef is sliced thin. It's tender. It's a great place. Good people. It's run by an Italian family. They have a lot of other dishes in there that are Italian dishes, meatballs and pasta and other stuff. It's a great place, great prices, great people. If you're in Chicago, you got to check it out. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 stars. I highly recommend it. There's a lot of other good food in here besides the beef. And it's in Schiller Park. And in my opinion, it's, it's one of Chicago's best. And the ice? The ice, um, I like the ice. It's got a good flavor to it, good lemon flavor. Not too much sugar. It's nice and tart. It's nice and sweet. I'd like it to be a little more finely uh, shaven, kind of like uh, Johnny's beef. But the flavor of the ice is great. The consistency of the ice could have been a little bit better. And that's why I think Rosie probably needs to try the Italian ice at Johnny's Beef. There we go. Uh, but uh, that's why I would give this place an 8 out of 10 stars. This beef is definitely superior to Johnny's Beef, but Johnny's, in my opinion, has the best uh, Italian ice in Chicago. So, But this is a great place. I give it an 8 out of 10 stars. Right. In my opinion, one of the best. 8 stars from him, 9 stars from me. This thing was all that and then some. Definitely worth the drive. Once again, thank you, Marshall, for paying it forward. You're welcome. And uh, yeah, thanks for being along, everybody. Woo! Woo!